A jury now deliberating in the retrial for a man previously convicted in the murder of a Palm Springs retiree and a scheme for money more than a decade ago. News Channel 3's Jake Ingrassi reports from the Larson Justice Center in India with the latest on this case we've now been following for about 15 years. The jury went into deliberations late Thursday morning after hearing closing arguments from the prosecution and defense. Prosecutors pushing for a conviction while the defense maintains that its client is innocent. The murder case against 40 year old Miguel Bustamante is now in the hands of the jury. He's back on trial in the 2008 financially motivated murder of Clifford Lambert, a wealthy 74 year old art dealer. Bustamante was convicted in the first trial, but four defendants, including Bustamante, appealed after the now retired judge was secretly recorded making homophobic statements. It's time for this to end. The lies, the fraud, the scheme. In his closing statement, Deputy District Attorney Robert Hightower told jurors the defendant risked everything for money but wants now to avoid responsibility. He alleges in a group of conspirators, Bustamante stabbed Lambert to death at his Palm Springs home, then dumped his body along a highway in Los Angeles County. This defendant, by his own hand, made a decision that money was more important than Mr. Lambert's life. And because of that, this defendant is guilty of all of the charges put forward in front of you. Defense attorney Boschke Katheria reminded jurors Bustamante is presumed innocent saying he fell victim to Kashal Narula, one of the other alleged conspirators. He was an unwitting pawn recruited in Narula's game, and he was seduced and taken advantage of by Mr. Narula. He's not a murderer, and he's innocent of the charges he's being accused of. And it's not clear how long these deliberations could take, but we are continuing to watch for a verdict. Jake Gracia, News Channel 3, Indio.